After years of planning and saving and building today, Spartanburg County opened its brand new courthouse to the public. Officials say the county raised $151 million for the new facility by passing a penny sales tax in 2017. And today the voters decision paid off. Our Peyton Furtado is live learning how and what led up to this. Hey Peyton. Yeah, Mark. Hi, Mark. It's good to see you all. Uh, yeah, everyone I spoke with today say it's really been a joint effort over the past few decades to make this happen, and it's going to be a representation of the county and its future. At 124 feet tall and 350,000 square feet, officials say Spartanburg County's new courthouse is as big and bright as the area's future. It easily looms over the former courthouse built back in 1957 and slated for demolition. We've known for a long, long time that a new courthouse needed to be built to serve the people of Spartanburg County. The call for a new courthouse started back in the early 2010s. We were running out of space. We were having to ask people to move out. Um, the public flow with the inmate flow and the judges flowing on the same hallways, just not safe. On top of that, the building struggled with leaks, sewage problems and mold. Former County Clerk of Court Hope Blackley and her staff were an instrumental part in bringing this to the public's attention and helping to push for a penny sales tax to pay for new facilities. To come in into a building that they can be proud of, feel good in, and um, not get sick. The county approved a penny sales tax in 2017 to replace the courthouse and some other county and city buildings. And it couldn't have come at a better time. Since 2010, the U.S. Census Bureau says Spartanburg has added more than 60,000 people to its population. Everything was spread out. So if, if, you, if you needed to go to get something taken care of, you may have to go to three different buildings. No more. It's a one-stop shop in Spartanburg. Monday, the brand new facility opened to the public for the first time. It's only cost to taxpayers now, basic upkeep, water and electricity, according to the clerk of court. Walking into a brand new building that is gorgeous and functional and has all that we need and we don't have a mortgage to pay on it, that to me is amazing. If you have a day in court coming up, make sure you don't go to that old facility on, at, at 180 Magnolia. We saw several people trying to get in today looking confused. Go to the facility behind it. It's the brand new one. You cannot miss it. Live in Spartanburg, I'm Peyton Furtano for WYFF News 4.